Hello, my hearties. A very, very good Monday morning to you. And a very warm welcome to Scotty McClue's pop-up live stream, live on Facebook Live, the big one. The one that everybody's talking about, the one everyone is watching. This is our big lockdown special. Thank you, thank you, thank you to everyone who joined us last night at 8 p.m. And you should be able to see the results of that live stream popping up on your Facebook Live page. Gordon Robertson says, hello. Hello, Gordon. A very good morning to you. Monday morning, of course, start of another week. And welcome, welcome, welcome. Lovely to have you with us. Um, what's interesting on here is when you post your good morning comment, then it pops up to tell me that you're watching. Quite interesting. I would have thought it should have gone the other way. Gareth Collins, good morning, Scotty. Dinky-doo. Morning, Scotty. This is Wayne Watson. Morning, Wayne. Lovely to have you all with us. And welcome to another week of Scotty McClue pop-ups, 10 a.m. sharp weekday mornings. Morning to you too, says Gordon Robertson. Yes, indeed. Tony Mack, welcome. Lovely to have you with us and a very good morning to you. Dinky-doo. Lorraine Harrison, good morning, Scotty McClure. Dinky-doo. Good morning to you, Lorraine. Lovely to have you with us and welcome. Pauline Young says, good morning, Scotty, from Isla. Lovely to have you with us. Which part of Isla are you in, Pauline? Are you in Beaumont? Are uh, are you a uh, are you in that um, where else have we got an Isla? It'll all come flooding back to me. Marcella Foyce watching us. Finley Morris, thank you. Thomas Peden is getting everyone up in the morning. Lorraine says good morning. Good morning, Lorraine, and uh, welcome, welcome, welcome. Lovely to have you with us. And Pauline, I don't know if you have the Gaelic, but Kamraha Uhakamachi. Lovely to have you with us. And uh, Finlay, Finlay, come on up you get. Calvin Allen, Peter Conley, Stephen Mooney, never a dull moment. Let's get sharing right away, guys, so that everybody knows. And if you can think of somebody that you can pop in, that would be fantastic. Uh, Thomas is getting everybody up. I love it. Fantastic. John Marshall. She's from Port Ellen. Ah, now was Port Ellen, Pauline. The hotel used to have a stuffed bear in the foyer. Am I right or am I wrong? Maybe you're too young to remember that. It's a long time ago I saw it. Uh, Gary Campbell, dinky do, because in those days what happened, the boat came into Port Ellen and went into West Loch Tarbert at the West Loch Pier, right at the top of the West Loch. So it didn't, uh, it didn't come into uh, Kenna Craig or, or further down. Clacken or anything like that. <coughs> Scotty, I apologize. I'm a couple of minutes late. A punishment exercise for me. Finley, you know fine that during lockdown, there are no penalties for being a little bit late. It's up to you to try and make it because the world is watching Scotty McClure at 10 o'clock in the morning on Facebook Live. It's what we do. Dinky do. Uh, Gordon Robinson says, uh, I'm going out for shopping, but not until you've popped back down at 11 a.m. Gordon Robertson, are you not just one of the finest men in the world? An absolute top man. Or as a friend of mine would say, he's a topper. He's a topper. <laughs> Elaine Andrews is watching. Dinky do. Nathan Baxter has joined us. Brian Hall has joined us. Guys, we need sharing. We need these figures up right away that's a piece of nonsense so what i'm going to do is i'm going to share this i know a lot of people won't be up and um you'll never guess what i did last night i will fess up i promise i will fess up bit of a confession but anyway share to the page so here it goes you'll all be listening from a clue fessing up as to what he did last night so here we are but i will tell you i promise you uh, so we're going to put to the big Scotty McClure page, which uh, the 6,000 of you have liked it. There's room for a lot more on there, I can tell you. Um, so there we are, right. So I'm just going to be sharing. I'll say, uh, what shall we say this morning to all the sleepy heads? Get up. Um, so we'll just put uh, live now, live now, um, up you get. <laughs> Up 
you get lovely. So there we are, live now. Up you get. <laughs> hey, that's the stuff for the sleepy heads in the morning. I can tell you. So that's gone off to the big Scotty McClue page. Right, who have we got here? Elaine Andrews, Nathan Baxter, the wonderful Brian Hall has joined us. Miller McToom, you're very welcome. Lovely to have you with us. And uh, Thomas says, going to start a watch party. Thomas, that's fantastic. Now, are you better to do a watch party now or um, at the end of the program? I don't know. I think you know a bit more about this than me, Thomas Biden, to be quite honest with you. Uh, William Cameron, Dinky Doo, David Diston, Dinky Doo. I just selected the platform because everybody told me it was brilliant. Paul Hunter, up you get, says Thomas. Excellent. Kane Spar, Craig Minty, go on up you all get. Longshanks, Lennarts. Long shanks. Nikki McHugh, up we get. Michael Farker, up we get. Fantastic. Great Thomas and Finlay, a wonderful piece of work. That's sh shoving the figures up already. Good morning, Scotty Dinky Doo, says the wonderful David Howie. Good morning, David. Welcome, welcome to our live pop ups Monday morning. Nothing gets past Scotty McClue. And we are chit chatting. There we are. Uh, Dubreden, Scotty, watch you or pull out the nettles in the garden. Oh, watch me, Miller McToom. The nettles can last for another 50 minutes or something like that. And watch how you grasp the nettle. There you go. Aidan Grimson, up we get. Thomas Speedon, thank you very much. Larry Donaldson, dinky do. Lovely to have Larry with us. How fantastic is that? Tot, 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 Finlay. From, uh, that's from Thomas, Thomas Bean. Uh, Alan Hall's watching. Morning, Scotty. How are you today, my friend? The lovely Margaret Sheldon. I am a big fan, Margaret. Lovely to have you with us. Welcome to our live, live stream. I call it a broadcast, actually, because it is effectively a broadcast, but it's a live stream. I'm using all the latest buzzwords there, you see. A dinky do, good man, says Brian Hall. And dinky do, Brian. Lovely to have you with us. Gordon Rich is watching. Morning, Scotty, from a very sunny county, Kildare. There we are. Gordon Ritchie, lovely to have you with us from the lovely county, Kildare. All these beautiful counties of Ireland. Um, hello, Scotty McClure. How are you today? Looks a nice day again. Kareem, absolutely. Lovely to have you with us. And Dinky Do. So there we go. Give us lots of hearts, guys. Lots of these. Um, Kareem, it's interesting. It tells me you're watching afterwards. Mario O'Donnell, morning, old bean. Now look you here, old bean. How can I say thank you for your thoughtfulness, your kindness, your generosity, your decency? You're being a wonderful, thoroughly decent human being. So there we are. That's all I'm going to say about you for now. So there you are. You can digest and ingest, ingest and digest that, Murray. But you know what I mean. So there we are. Justin Brazil, dinky doo. Richie McCusker, dinky doo. Mark Kelsey's watching, dinky doo. Uh, Mark Kelsey. Um, it's something I don't like doing, but I'd ask that if you do have any contributions, they'd be very welcome at paypal.me forward slash Scotty McClure. And uh, just there's kindness. There's, let me just say there's a lot of kindness out there. Because, guys, what I do with it, actually, I use it for advertising, and I'm going to save up and buy equipment. Fantastic stuff. Uh, morning from the Red Valley, says Mark Kelsey. Mark Kelsey, lovely to have you with us. Sir Mark Kelsey, Justin Brazil, your thoughts on Boris's speech this morning? Yes, did you see that? I put that up for you. What he was saying is it's a lockdown business as usual. So there we are. He was really saying uh, he knows it's frustrating, but we have to just stick with it and run with the ball for now. And um, I think that's the most sensible thing because, guys, all nations in the world are staring death in the face 
I don't want to put you on a downer because this program is an upper, but that's what's happening. You have to survive. So even if we can't see Granny and Auntie Fanny, I'm afraid survival for them and for you, for the rest of us, is paramount. 100% importance, survival. All right, so there we go. Um, Molly from down south, just in Brazil. That is what I say. Mary Lindsay's watching. Good morning, Mary. Lovely to have you with us and a very, very warm welcome to our live stream. We're a big family. We pop up at 10 o'clock every weekday morning and 8 o'clock on a Sunday night. So you'll hopefully be able to see last night's efforts. Efforts, just see what I just did there. As if it's an effort talking to you beautiful people. My goodness me. Uh, us viewers are better doing watch parties when you are live than you do them on all the other pages you have when you're live, excluding the one you're live on. Oh, fantastic, Thomas Peden. Well, you know where the big Scotty McClue page is. So if you want to share it with that one, you'll see there's about 6,000 likes on it. You might have to... Um, you might have to put Scotty McClure into your search engine. There's never a dull moment with you, Scotty Friendly Morris. You say the loveliest things. Dinky do. Gemma and Marie McCree has joined us. Mauro Bear is here. Hello, Mauro. How are you? Buongiorno, buongiorno. Lovely to have you with us. Bellissimo, bellissimo. Bravo, bravo, bravissimo, Mauro. So there we are. Morning, Scotty. Morning, Gemma and Marie McCray. Lovely to have you with us and a big dinky do to you. More sharing, guys. We cannot let these figures slip. Jack, good morning. God and Stilling, good morning, McClure. Congratulations and much respect to you. Come, come, come your ties like a dog's dinner because it was a wee bit tight. And I remember my old head of singing. See what I just did there. Head of singing, a lovely, lovely man called David Kelly. And he was the head of singing at the Royal Scottish Academy of Music and Drama. And he said to me, a beautiful deep voice, he was a basso profundo and had been the principal bass at Covent Garden, the uh, Royal Opera House. And he was the head of singing at the Royal Scottish Academy. Lovely man. Any uh, former students will remember David Kelly and a great big giant of a man, beautifully dressed. And he had a very deep voice. I don't know if I can get down to David Kelly's son. And he would say to me, Son, don't never speak or sing with anything too tight round your neck, because it puts strain on uh, on your larynx, on your voice box. So there we are. So that was it. So I followed the wonderful David's advice. Lovely, even talking about him makes me smile. He was a super guy. Um, morning, Scotty. Morning, Matthew McGuigan. Lovely to have you with us. And uh, a very warm welcome to our pop-up. More sharing, more sharing, more sharing, more steam. Could we have more steam, please, McPhail, from the engine room? Anybody know what that's from? Anybody get any ideas? More steam, McPhail. You know, look at we're being overtaken by the seagulls. <laughs> that bud's paddling. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Now, um, what have we got? Share to a page. We've done that one. Uh, share now in public. We've done that one. Share to your story. We'll do that. We'll share to the story and see if we can get people actually getting their act together and putting this on. Uh, William Winsborough is watching. William, welcome, welcome, welcome. See what I did in terms of alliteration there. Welcome, William Winsborough. There we are. It's not for the faint-hearted to say that one. Uh, Murray O'Donnell, more power to you, Scotty. Oh, bless you. More power to you, sir. Wonderful. What a top man. I'm just, I'm just so grateful because it makes a huge difference. Daniel McGraw. Uh, get up. Thomas Speedon is giving you a three liner. Um, Gemma and Marie McCray, how do you do today, Scotty? Do you see what you did there, Gemma Ann? You did a lovely poem. You said, Gemma and Marie McCray, how are you doing today? 
See? Lovely stuff. A very good morning from Italy. Dinky do. Fantastic, Scotty. Mauro, lovely to hear you. Are you getting a slight easing of the lockdown, Mauro? What's to happen? I'm hearing news from Italy, but I'd rather hear it from the horse's mouth. So there we are. We are right around the world here on uh, Scotty McClure. So there we are. Dinky do. Buongiorno to you. A really sunny morning here in St. Anne's on Sea. Oh, Brian Hall, stop! You're making me homesick for St. Anne's. Scotty McClure, you see, is a citizen of the world. And I go to, I go to, oh, fantastic places. Very, very interesting places. And all the interesting places I've been fortunate enough to work in in my life. One of them being Preston, and I stayed very close to the M55, and um, not so close that you could hear it on a on a bad day. But uh, I stayed, and I would very often pop out to Lytham for maybe an afternoon tea. So perhaps I've I've sat with you in one of the tea rooms, Brian Hall, and not realised at the time. Daniel Brennan's watching, Scotty. Uh, yes, thank you. Daniel Brennan, dinky do. Stop it, Thomas. Uh, Scotty McClure, I was shocked last night. That woman saying you're annoying and hates your voice. What a sad individual. If she feels that, do not watch. Move on. Her loss, not yours. Very kind of you, Kareem. Thank you. But you will get that. I mean, I might not be everybody's cup of tea. And I've always said, you can like me or you can hate me. It doesn't matter to me as long as you love me. You see, that's what's important. We love each other. We might not like each other, but we do love each other. Very important. Uh, good morning, McClure. Congratulations. Much gratitude and respect to you. I'm coming on your ties like a dog's dinner. We've done that when Gordon's still there. I've just explained that. Think you do, Scotty, says the wonderful Jack Medleys. The lovely Susan Forrest watching. Um, Thomas Payden, David Bonds, get out of bed. Justin Brazil, one day in the sun and the garden and I got sunburn. Justin, you must be careful. I remember hearing a story when the Argyles were deployed to Aden, to the Yemen. And um, this was 1967. And um, they had a very, very brilliant commanding officer called Lieutenant Colonel Colin Mitchell. And the press had dubbed him Mad Mitch, but he certainly wasn't mad at all. And he was just an excellent officer. And uh, he took them all down to, I think it might have been Plymouth or something like that, put them all into a gym and turned the heating right up. And uh, they were going, oh, so, so, oh, God, he passed out. And he went, the reason I've done this is because this is what you're going to meet when you walk off that plane. Wonderful. Great, great leadership. Gemma and Marie McRae, how does that, now how do people on Facebook can't get you? Um, how does people that not Facebook can get you? Um, oh no, they're getting us, they're coming on to Facebook and they're coming on, they're seeing Scotty McClure and they're saying, I don't like him, but they're still watching. And this was the same in radio and in television. When you give him the steam off my tea. Uh, what time's he on, by the way? Because I want to listen. Uh, Thomas, PMSL, cleaning notifications, mate. Who's this guy anyway? Daniel Brennan. Have you just joined us from another planet? Welcome, welcome, welcome to Earth. Scotty McClure, if you don't know Scotty McClure, that's absolutely fine. Um, you know, we have... All of the human race knows Scotty McClure. Well-behaved outsiders are allowed. Uh, the animal kingdom are watching. Oh, yes, not a problem. Who's this guy anyway? Who, who, who are you? Who are you, Daniel? You tell us. Uh, did you hear about, um, oh, my goodness, Jack Merley's, yes, terrible news. I'll not read that out, Jack, because it's so sad. Uh, Holly Anderson's watching Dinky Doo, Holly. 
Uh, lovely to have you with us, and welcome, welcome, welcome. So there we go. I haven't faced up to what I did late last night. Good morning, Margaret. And, of course, Scotty says, Noggins, Richie. Morning, Noggins. We love Daniel there. Who's, who's, that, who's this guy? Uh, David Phelps watching. Welcome, David. Lovely to have you with us. Para handy. Absolutely, David Philp. There we are. Great to have you with us. I wonder if you're a distant relative of me. I had a relative who was called Philp, who lived in Fife in Glenrothes. So there we are. Lovely man. Bill Philp. Para handy. Yes, it has more steam McPhail. We're being overtaken by the seagulls. And of course, seagulls fly a lot faster than us. That bird's paddling. <laughs> what is Scotty not ahead from you since the Scott FM days Patrick Murphy what a lovely lovely reunion great to have you with us and what we're talking about here is perhaps setting up a late night chat either Facebook live or YouTube so there we go somebody said you could do the two simultaneously but I think it's a subscription and I don't have the money for that James Watrip, morning, Scotty McClure, Robert Rovers, St. Anne's near Blackpool, Scotty. Absolutely, Gemma and Marie McCray. You're 100% correct. There we are. You live in Lytham. You don't want to live in Lytham when you're elderly, but it's the law. You're always my cup of tea, Scotty. I thank you, Finlay. Thank you very much. Lovely to have you with us. Alex Martin's watching. So sad, Scotty, that uh, lost. They can move on. They can move on. It always amazed me when people used to phone me up to tell me they weren't enjoying the show. <laughs> they used to say we got a proper presenter. Uh, Jared Clacken, up you get, dinky do. Thomas Peden has decreed it. Gemma Ann Marie McClay says, beautiful weather, Scotty, because my health, I can't go out in it. Can you get uh, a wee bit of fresh air, Gemma Ann? I don't know, um, but there we are. But you don't want to be out and about with, uh, with your condition. In this world, there are always people that are going to hate you or be jealous of you. I'm sure you've seen this over the years in your profession. We should all be at peace and try to respect, absolutely respect for all, I say, Kareem. You know, I've only met one bad man in the world, and he facilitated the loss of my life savings uh, through a business venture that uh, could have been extremely successful. And that's the only bad person I've ever met. So there we are. So respect for all I say. My big brother was asking, dinky do, big brother. Big brother's watching us. Oh, oh. Phil Simes watching, dinky do, Phil. Lovely to have you with us, you top, top man. Um, Scotty, can you remind me how to tie my shoelaces? as it's that long since I've worn my shoes. Noggins, Richie, I understand. I do it, uh, take the two laces, one in each hand. I do left over right and under, pull it tight. I take the right, make it into a bow, and then pop the left under and draw it through. Uh, just nice and slowly, there's no rush. I can remember the first time I learned to tie my shoes. It was last week, and no, <laughs> so I remember when I learned to tie my shoes, I was just a tiny one, and my lovely grandmother had shown me, and um, I went outside into the garden and practiced, you know, a wee boy practicing, and then I got it right, and I was chuffed to bits. Shuffed. These are the important things in life. People talk about how much money have people got? Very little at the moment. So there we go. Uh, Scotty, can you... Uh, oh, yes. I love Scotty, says Gemma Ann. Thank you, Gemma Ann. We love you. And it's very, very good of you to join us. Um, so there we are. Yes, yes, Scotty. We're easing our lockdown. Oh, sorry. This is from Mauro. So I do Italian, yes. Yes, yes, Scotty, we're now easing our lockdown here. We're allowed to kiss our horses. Even bravo, bravissimo, Scotty. Mauro, I have to tell you, I remember, I'm not sure what movie it's in, but it was two guys, and uh, there were two Italian guys, 
and they were holding each other's cheeks and uh, snapping each other's face. Hey, hey, you listen to what I tell you. Hey, hey, hey. And he goes, hey, why are we slapping each other's faces? He says, because we're Italian. <laughs> I can remember I used to, when I was a student, I used to eat at this lovely cafe across the road. And the waiter was Italian. We, we nicknamed him Pedro. We used to say, come on, we'll go see Pedro. And we used to go in. And Pedro, they would, if there wasn't uh, a, a big crowd in, because uh, we went in quite early, then some of the guys would be sitting in the corner playing cards. And the Italian was flowing at a wonderful, wonderful speed. He was flowing allegro, vivace. He was flowing vivace. The chat was vivace. And, um, chatting away, and this guy, and the manager shoved him in the back, he went, hey, and he goes, what? He goes, shut up. <laughs> uh, very good morning to you, Scotty, from Callum McSwan. So there you are, dinky do to the nation. Um, what have we got here? Thought of the day, the principles of living greatly include the capacity to face trouble with courage, disappointment with cheerfulness, and trial with humility. Dinky doo to you, Scotty, and the nation are friends across the world. I'm going to read that out again, Callum McSwan. That's beautiful. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Wonderful. A very good morning to you, Scotty. Thought of the day. The principles of living greatly include the capacity to face trouble with courage, disappointment with cheerfulness, and trial with humility. Fantastic. Dinky do to you and the nation and our friends across the world. Callum, that was beautiful. Thank you very much. More sharing, guys. More sharing. Velcro shoes are the best, says Thomas. Yes, but does anybody think Velcro can be a ripoff? Now, uh, St. Anne's is an amazing beach, says the wonderful Brian Hall. Yes, absolutely. Melanie Gilmer, dinky do, lovely to have you with us. Some of you are just getting that, aren't you? Uh, Melanie says, dinky do from Mel in Australia. Been in hospital. Waiting for open heart surgery, Wednesday. Good to hear your happy voice. Melanie Connor, I bow down to you, my darling. I send you love. I send you strength. I send you the power to overcome this. I send love to your beautiful heart. We are going to mend your broken heart that's what we're going to do for you. The power of thought, the power of prayer for Melanie Gilmer in Oz. And I'm going to give her the ultimate Scotty McClue accolade for somebody from Oz. The hat, the hat's going on. Quick change. Dinky do, fair dinkum, Mel. It's your old friend here with his jackaroo on. Ready to start shearing the sheep. <laughs> Fantastic. So there we go. Fair dinkum, I say, and good day. Great to have you with us, Mel, and every strength for the op. They'll know exactly what they're doing, and they'll send you back even better than you are just now. There you go, my love. Mwah. Love from the whole world to Melanie Gibson in Oz. Right, I'm going to take my jackaroo off now. I'm going to do a quick change. There we go. Hey! Ho ho! Now, guys, any way you can up this stream, because I want the world to be watching at 10 o'clock British summer time every single morning. So it's up to you to do all the sharing. Start watch parties. Share a watch party on, uh, on your... Um, you know what I'm talking about here, your timeline. Now, I had to think of the terminology there. Wonderful. Lorraine Harris is watching. Jim Higgins. Good morning, Scotty, says Lorraine Harrison. Remember when my mum was in hospital? Well, she's celebrating 80 years old today. Happy birthday to mum, Lorraine. That is fantastic. 
There we are. I can't play the happy birthday because of the copyright, but we can wish Mum a very happy birthday. What we'll do, we'll give her a big round of silent applause. Fantastic! And we'll give her three big silent cheers. Are we ready? There you are. That's for your mum. Give her a big hug from Scotty McClue. Uh, Charlene Haining Lockwood. Good morning, Scotty. Good morning, Charlene Haining Lockwood. Now, there's a big name, guys. I can tell you that for starts. Lovely to have you with us, Charlene. Scotty McClure, what comes around goes around. I'm sure that that business partner will get what's coming to him. Sadly, greed and corruption is at every level in society. Absolutely, Kareem. And I remember saying he's the only bad person I've ever met. And uh, somebody else said, well, do be careful. There are a few of them out there, a lot of them out there. So there we are. Melanie Gilmer, dinky do, Velcro shoes, Beth, she says. David Bonds, are you watching yet? Come on. Thomas Peden has decreed. Guys, figures are dropping. I need to tell 10 to tell 10. More sharing. Sorry, but sharing. We've got to, yes, figures are paramount. We must get this up. Can everybody share right now? Uh, I'll share to a group and let them know. Yes, we'll share to the Scotty McClue fan group. I hope you're all members of that, by the way. The Scotty McClue fan group. Very, very important. So this is going out. Share on the timeline. Uh, no, we're not doing that. We're going to the Scotty McClue fan group. Scotty... Have you all started watch parties, guys? So there we are, Scotty McClure fan group. There we are. Good morning. Live now. Right, good morning, live now, and this is going out to a group. Are you doing the same, please? Very, very important, get sharing. It's all in the sharing, guys. You might not know this, but it is. It's all in the sharing. And of course, as the weeks go on, we will all meet here, 10 o'clock, God willing, weather permitting. That's British summertime, if you need to do any adjusting. So there we are. And I'll put a Scotty into that. And up should come the group. It says, what's the group? This old computer's a bit uh, slow. Uh, so it's wonderful stuff. I'll just be back with you in seconds. And we'll get going there seconds away. Seconds away, round two. Good morning, live now. That's gone to the Scotty McClure group right now, guys. So we should be getting that. Oh. And if you can share it right across social media. Uh, Connor Cassidy, up we get. How about a song, Scotty? Well, I can't really give you a song because of the copyright, Thomas. So there you are. I can play little bits of maybe a wee sacred song or something on the organ. Uh, David Lafferty's watching. What a top man. Welcome, David. It's been a wonderful pop-up this morning, but lovely to have you with us. Michael Yule's watching. Melanie Gilmer says, loving the hat. Thank you. <laughs> Mel liked her hat. My jackaroo, Mel. You'll know about the jackaroo hat. Proper stuff. Uh, Scotty, you ooze charisma. Finley Morris, stop. I'm not be able to get my bonnet on. But very, very kind of you. You all ooze charisma, the whole lot of you. I had to say last night on last night's pop-up, which you should be able to get a hold of. If not, it's on the YouTube channel, youtube.com forward slash user forward slash Scotty McClue 1. And uh, you should be able to get on to that. Um, and you will uh, see that I was saying what's lovely and wonderful, one of the many, many things that's lovely and wonderful about this stream is that we have no idiots on it. Everybody on here is a top human being. It's wonderful. There's not a single idiot on here. So there you go. It's wonderful. And if any of you have been told you're stupid when you were younger or school or anything like that, forget that. Not one stupid person on this stream right now. Uh, can I get a birthday shout out? Says Longshanks Leonard. You can, Longshanks. Happy birthday. 
to Longshanks Leonard. So there we are. I won't ask where you got your first name. Morning, sir. This is David Lafferty. Morning, David. How are you, sir? Lovely to have you with us. You should Skype me, David. Scotty Dot McClue. We'll put the Skype on. We want an evening with Scotty McClue, a Q&A when lockdown's over, and merchandise. Thomas Peden, yes. I was wondering, a Q&A, what would you like a Q&A on? Just broadcasting, life, Scotty McClue, I was wondering about doing an actual separate live Q&A session, either on uh, YouTube Live or here. Uh, Margaret Sheldon, Scotty, do you think this lockdown is getting me to find my scissors? Do you think this lockdown is getting to me? Found my scissors in the freezer yesterday. Margaret Sheldon, I know this is not a one-up show, but let me top that one for you. Lost the car keys one morning, had them in my hand, lost them. All I could think I'd done, all I'd done was go from the washing machine to the back green and hang out the washing. That's all I'd done. Check the back green, check the washing machine, check the whole kitchen, no car keys. So turn the hoose upside down, long story short. No car keys. Looked in the clothes peg bag, a wee bag that hangs up on the whirly gig, and it's got the clothes pegs in it. Here were the car keys. I'd been hanging stuff out. I'd got a hole in my trouser pocket. I thought these keys are going to drop down. Now. I'll just pop them in here for now. Oh... What is that like, Scotty? So there you are. Yes, the lockdown's probably getting to us all, but this will keep us all sane or drive us all mad, one or the other. Uh, shared an answer to my story. How's the dog today? Mine was a rascal last night, keeping me up all night. Karim, I don't wish to counter that, but my wee man slept the whole night on his chair, and I went down this morning and gave him a kiss right between the eyes, just there. You know the wee channel up from his nose between his eyes? Just a wee kiss, good morning there. And the tail goes. The tail goes. So there we are. I wonder what he was doing up. Something must have disturbed him, Kareem. Um, you know, did you take him out too late? Or not late enough? Or whatever? Gary Davis is watching. Thank you, dear Gary. Lovely to have you with us. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Guys, sharing, sharing, sharing. Uh, a bit on bind us together on the organ. Bind us together, Lord. You're, you're, Thomas Peden, you're a big ask, you know. You'll be the end of me. I don't know any of these tunes, and I haven't practiced them, so I'd have to guess. I'll, I'll give it a go. Bind us together, Lord. If this is a disaster, you're getting it, right? So there we go. Now, I'll lower that down so you can see the organ. Because somebody said last week, Scotty, we don't actually know if you're playing that or pressing a button. So there we are. There is the organ. Can we see the organ? Yes. And you're wanting bind us together, Lord. <laughs> Is that it? So there we go. Was that anywhere even close? Do tell. Spill, I say. Old McClue on the organ. And uh, there we are. A bit of bind us together. Was that a bit of bind us together, Thomas Peden? Spill. Can I get a happy birthday, please, Scotty? It will make my day. Longshanks Leonard, we can't sing it because of the copyright, but we can wish you a very Happy birthday. So there you go, dinky do. Andrew Southwest watching, Longshanks Leonard's watching. Uh, have we got um, Kevin Brennan's watching, dinky do, Kevin? Have we got 
Lots and lots going out there, guys. I'll smart myself up. My ties slipped a wee bit. So there we are. I'm looking a wee bit of a... My mother used to say, you look a terrible ticket. I don't know where that came from. You look a ticket. So there we are. Another one was, you look like a guy. So I assume that that meant you look like Guy Fox. So there we are. You look a guy in that, by the way. Um, Kevin Brennan, happy birthday, Long Shanks. Hope you have a great day. It can only go downhill after this pop-up. Says <laughs> Fiddly. All right, we're going to have to share, guys. Going to have to share. Don't, want, don't let the figures drop. Oh, I say I'll only do the pop-ups as long as you guys want them. So don't worry about me overstaying my welcome. Uh, you know, I, I'll only do them as long as it suits you guys. So there we are. Uh, you should write your memoirs, Scotty. I guarantee it'll be featured on Oopla. My memoirs, actually, although I say it myself, I think, you know, at first I thought, would that interest anybody? Why? Oh, you know, Willie Drysdale's watching Tom Speed and Lester Sutherland. How are you, Lester? How's Orkney? Thomas is talking to an Orcadian. There we are. Is that not fabulous? Uh, Longshanks, Leonard, James, Alexander, Jack, Arthur, get on this. Absolutely. Big style. Ian Kerr's watching Dinky Doo. My old neighbour, Skipper's the SS Sir Walter Scott from the Trossachs Pier. Now, let me think of a pier in Loch Katrin. Did you ever shovel coal doon a blow? Uh, no, Murray, I've not had that privilege because I worked on the uh, Ashton and the Ashton had two four-cylinder Glenifers from Annie's Land in Glasgow, the Glenifer Engine Company. And I'll tell you, they were 48 horsepower each and I used to look after them so there was no coal shoveling. Um, but uh, you can take a holiday on a wonderful a Highland steamboat holiday, or you could, I think you can now, well, after lockdown, obviously, on the Vic 32, which I think goes out of Crinan on the Crinan Canal. And uh, it's a run by lovely, lovely people. And they used to do Highland steamboat holidays. So you could still cruise on a puffer, and you got uh, looked after. They did all the cooking. Rachel did all the cooking. Nick did all the skippering and seeing to the engine. And there were lovely people, and they would turn on the steam and let you see this beast of an engine. Beautiful thing. As soon as you put the steam on, she went, <laughs> and did a sort of half ton of the, of the engine. And so that's that. The, the cylinders filled up and went up and down. And the Sir Walter Scott is 1900. So she's 120 years old and is one of the peers Stronach Lachlar. Have I got that right? Stronach Lachlar. So there we are. So I was in these and then my boss bought the Countess of Bredalbin, but by that stage I'd left, I'd gone on to other things and she had two six-cylinder Glenifers. She became the Countess Fiona owned by Aloha Breweries, and she sailed on Loch Lomond. And she had uh, six-cylinder Glenifers. And there is a, an old London fireboat, there's pictures of Churchill on her, called the Massey Shaw. And uh, Massey Shaw was the head of the London Fire Brigade, Captain Shaw. And Gilbert and Sullivan included Captain Shaw in their opera, or operetta, Iolanthe. They sang up to the balcony and said, Oh, Captain Shaw. Um, and uh, it said, Could thy brigade with cool cascade? You see, and that was, I think, the Fairy Queen. I think it was an aria by the, the Fairy Queen and included Captain Shaw of the London Fire Brigade. So he must have been in the audience, Massey Shaw, and the fireboat that uh, kept London safe during the war or did its best, the Massey Shaw, I think she'd been restored, and she had two eight-cylinder Glenifers. And what you would do, you'd rev these big diesels right up and put on the pumps, and you got this huge jets of water for uh, fighting fires from the river, a warehouse, another ship that had gone on fire, and you'll see Winston Churchill 
on the uh, foredeck of the Massey Shaw. There's a wee bit of info for you. Uh, so there we are. So the, the Sir Walter Scott, and she steams, so she doesn't put out. Obviously, Loch Catherine provides the water for Glasgow in the west, and uh, she steam so that she doesn't put out any pollution into the loch. Isn't that gorgeous? She's been sailing for 120 years. Gorgeous old thing. Also, happy birthday to you and Maguire, Scotty, says Longshanks. Absolutely Longshanks. Thomas Peden, Bolt. Yes, Thomas Peden, says Longshanks. That's absolutely lit, says Longshanks. Getting tearful after that, Scotty. That was fantastic. Finley Morris, did you like that? So there we are. And I used to look after the engines in the Ashton, and she would go over to uh, Guruk to Helensburgh. And um, there's pictures of the king and queen, King George VI, the queen's father, King George VI, and um, Queen Elizabeth, the queen mother, going on the Ashton during the war to go out to uh, big battleships that were sitting at the tail of the bank in Greenock. Uh, I feel like I should be doing the offertory procession. Did you like that, Thomas? Did I get the tune right? That's a nice organ you're playing, Gordon Robertson. We like the best of organs, don't we? Uh, Scotty, can you wish my pal Willie Pearson a happy birthday? Jack Arthur, of course I can. Happy birthday, Willie Pearson, and many happy returns. I once gave a friend of mine a boomerang, and I wished him many happy returns. Uh, so there were a few off notes, but we could make it out. You've made judges' houses. So there we are. Bind us together, Lord. What off notes? What notes were off? Give me a note of the notes that were off, and I'll sharpen them or flatten them for you. Uh, William Cameron Dinky do Like a pun of men, says Murray O'Donnell. Uh, Thomas Peden. Yes, all good, Thomas. A bit fed up with no football of any kind. Looks like we won't be back to work until the end of July at the earliest. How's you and your family, says the wonderful Lester Sutherland. Yes, will you Scotty McClure's show for a conversation? I like it. Uh, dinky do, Scotty. Top of the morning to you, says the lovely Nikki Graham. Nikki Graham, welcome, welcome, welcome. Mwah, mwah. Lovely to have you with us. What's the time? My goodness, we time flies. I'm loving this. It takes me back to the old Scott FM days when I was wee, a 10-year-old, sneaking up to listen to wee fat bub and then yourself, Matthew McGuigan. What I've been saying to people, guys, take this on board. If you get fed up having a swatch at my coupon, and I quite understand it would be easy to do so, um, what you must do is... Put on all the Scotty McClue pop-ups you can find and listen to them as if they were radio. Because I was doing some editing the other day of one of the pop-ups and it was playing and I thought, do you know, this is no half bad. And I thought to myself, everybody needs to see this. And I also thought, this sounds, I could hear it, this sounds like the radio. So if you go to Scotty McClure's YouTube channel, you'll see all the pop-ups from here and put them on and then go about your business and leave them booming out around your house. And trust me, you will be informed, educated and entertained. Can any other public service broadcaster make that same claim? Oh, -ho, there we go. The gauntlet is down. Uh, Gordon Robertson, I find the pop-ups good. It's a bit of community chat. I find it helps with the morale. Gordon Robertson, you see the loveliest things. That's exactly what it's designed to do. There we are. And when you've all had enough, I shall just disappear. Uh, smashing Lester, I know I miss it greatly myself. I can't wait till it's back. We're all good mates, keeping busy. Hope Crispy's well. We'll need to organize a gig after lockdown. John Marshall can <laughs> tan your whiskey again and turn the island upside down. Ah, I take it you're talking to Shetland. Stronachlachla, says Murray O'Donnell. Fantastic, Murray. So there we go. Oops, sorry, says Matthew McGuigan. No, Matthew, you're fine. Uh, Kareem, Scotty McClure, can I have purchase... 
can I have purchases a reciprocating saw for the God I have purchased? Uh, he's got to become a victim of predictive text, haven't we all? Scott and McClure, I have purchased a reciprocating saw for the garden. So hopefully everything goes well. Any tips? Yes, just be yourself. Use it well and wisely and take great care. I'm not sure exactly what the reciprocating saw does. Chris Shaw can all. Uh, I, Chris Shaw can all. We can all see you. You have a mind full of information, Scotty. You learn something new every day. I'm loving it. Margaret Sheldon, we do our best. There's stacks of it up there, my dear. All the pop-ups in the world, we would never empty the old memory because um, I had to learn all that stuff. There were, there were no search engines, so people would come on and ask me things, and it could be from miners' pensions to how to start 132 horsepower six-cylinder Kelvin diesel, you know, to how to fly a Spitfire. With a guy on one night, and he said he was a Spitfire pilot. Now, I know the takeoff routine for the Spitfire. So I asked him to talk us through the takeoff. He goes, oh, well, uh, I'll do that in a minute. I said, no, no, if you could do that just now, please. <laughs> He's going, well, you can, uh, you start it up, you know, and switch it on and start it up. Mm -hmm. And uh, we went through the whole thing, and I had to say to him, you've just crashed because he'd done something wrong. Any Spitfire pilots out there or enthusiasts that would know what he'd done wrong. Morning, Scotty. Dinky do, says Kane Spur. Dinky do, Kane. Lovely to have you with us. Time for a wee sip of water, methinks. Oh, making a mess here. Dropping it all over the place. <laughs> My father's desk. Can I have a warm welcome for Chris Shaw and all, Scotty? Of course we can. Ma Robert, see. Si. Hey, Scotty, by the way, but are you Glaswegian? Yes, I'm Glaswegian, Mauro. Well, uh, Grenokian origin, then Glasgow, yes. But um, what uh, I find, I used to love have a lot of Italian friends in Glasgow, and very few of them have lost their accent, thank goodness. It's a very difficult accent to change Italian because it goes, it lives in you. It's a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful language. And the language of music, of course, lento, lento, presto, presto, vivace, allegro, allegretto, largo, um, pianissimo, fortissimo. What about doing Scotty McClure podcasts? Gordon Robertson, what would the difference be with, between a podcast and what we actually do here. Uh, Scott McClure, good Monday show today to start the week. You have a good day. Speak tomorrow. Dinky do Karim. Ah, bless you, sir. Take care of your dear self. What a top man. Check flaps and chocks away. Tally ho. Um, no, no, no. This is not about somebody's private life, Murray. Come up. There's, there's more to it. So come on. You should know how to fly a Spitfire. Hi from Glen Rothes, Martin Bond, thank you, dear. I've not heard him talking about this for a while. Have you been intimidated into silence? No, God and Robertson, morning show. Wonderful Derek Mary's watching, one of our top broadcasters. Also, a fantastic wizard of the big switchboard, if I may say so. There we are, thank you, dear Derek Mary. I hope you are well, and I hope you are merry, and all is going well for you. Take great care of your dear self during this very trying and testing time, I say. Lovely to have you all with us, guys. Excellent stuff. Uh, what's happening to you? Oh, my goodness. It's time I wasn't here. Fantastic, fantastic show this morning, guys. Brilliant, brilliant show last night. If you're able to see it on the news feed, I'll try and put it up, but I'm not sure what comes up. Long Shanks Leonard, can you adopt me, Scotty? <laughs> Adele Di Falco, hi from an Italian girl, she says. See, si, see si Adele, excellent. Bellissimo. Long Shanks Leonard, <laughs> to be adopted by Scotty McClure. Everybody's papa. 
course. It's wonderful, isn't it? Uh, that's what we want. Can we have the goodbye song today? Yes, we can, Finlay. No reason why not. And I'll even play it for you as well. Right, are we ready to go, guys? Now, join me tomorrow at 10 o'clock sharp. 10 o'clock sharp, right? Say hi to my pal, Rapfree the Brig, and Rapfree Clyde Bank. I will, Derek Mary. Uh, Rapfree the Brig and Rapfree Clyde Bank. Coat Brig and Bank. A banky and a coat brigger. A brigger, you can't beat it. Barry Smith's watching. Welcome, Barry. Dinky do. You're just in time for us to push off. Everybody's going, oh, please, would you? So that sort of stuff. But uh, do, do join us tomorrow, 10 o'clock sharp. Share and share and share and share, guys. Share. Share the heck out of this. Uh, looking forward to Tuesday at 10.01 a.m. You're usually one minute late. Gordon Robertson, you'll need to sort that watch of yours. Uh, thanks again, Scotty, and it will be expensive to get it put right, I can tell you. Right, I'm going to play you the goodbye song. <laughs> and then I'll sing it for you. <laughs> Wonderful. Right, are we ready? Are we ready? There we go. There we are. Last song. Are we ready? Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. Take care, everybody, as you go. Goodbye, everybody. Of it all, say no revoir and cheerio. See you, my darlings. Stay fabulous. Stay safe. Stay at home. Stay beautiful. And I'll see you all tomorrow at 10, God willing, weather permitting. Ta-da, lads, this is Scotty McClure saying to every single one of you, dinky-doo. Goodbye, Scotty. Godspeed. Godspeed, Mario, darling.